Today is Wednesday, March 9th, and this is Citrus TV Now. It's currently 37 degrees and snowing here in Syracuse. I'm Bradley Hoppenstein. Here are today's top stories. New details on how many students can travel over spring break. SU Student Association is offering transportation for students departing from campus. Students can take shuttles to New York City, Philadelphia, Boston, Washington, D.C., and Rockway, New Jersey. Shuttles will also be available to take students to the Syracuse Airport. Check-in for students begins 30 minutes before departure. Shuttles will leave College Place this Friday beginning at 1 and 5 in the afternoon. Shuttles will return to campus on Sunday, March 20th. There are 54 seats available for students per shuttle. Students can register for a spot on the Syracuse University website. The 2022 Toner Prizes for Excellence in Political Reporting will take place virtually on Monday, March 28th at 7 p.m. House Speaker Nancy Pelosi will serve as the keynote speaker this year. The event will be hosted by SU alum Karen Tumulty of The Washington Post and Boris Sanchez of CNN. You must register in advance to receive the Zoom link. And Syracuse men's basketball is moving on in the ACC tournament. The Orange defeated Florida State 96-57 earlier today. SU will face number one ranked Duke in the conference tournament quarterfinals tomorrow at noon. And coming up on News Live at 6, the city of Syracu Syracuse hosts Green Beer Sunday. Citrus TV reporter Tegan Brown will tell you about the significance of this year's celebration. But until then, that's all the time we have for you today on Citrus TV Now. For more of the latest, feel free to follow us at Citrus TV News on Twitter or check out our website at CitrusTV.com. I'm Bradley Hoppenstein. Have a great evening, Syracuse.